weather was kind of bad last night. It was just a bunch of rain and cold and nasty. Well, I only count 13 this morning. We should have 14, so let's go see what we can see. Like we have a lamb, and it looks to be from one of Reba's lambs I kept back last year, if you guys remember. She had one baby and this year it looks like she has one baby so i'm gonna just quietly shush her in and lock her up for until lunchtime and i'm gonna take a look at them but hi mama belly's dropped hey reese <coughs> look his belly's dropped so this little fellow was born this morning that's his mom. His mom is a Reba's second set of lambs. So the first set was Cheyenne. Cheyenne I sold. The second set, Reba had twins. She had a ram and an e-lamb. And I kept both of them. So the ram is actually servicing one of my friends. And the ewe, um, which is her, she had a lamb last year. She had you lamb last year. This year she had a ram lamb that is a single. So she had it this morning. We're gonna weigh, we're gonna tag, and give it some omega-3, and give the mom some Nutri-Drench. So it was really weird yesterday I said, Reba and her lamb looked very close. Her, they're, both their vulvas were about the same in swelling, pink. Their bags were about the same. So I was like, any day now, they're both gonna have probably at the same time. Well, my granny said yesterday, I bet they have on the worst weather. So they did. She actually had it here. I just saw she passed the placenta, which I'll show you guys later. If you don't wanna see it, just skip through it. It's just part of life. People have them, animals have them. Um, most of the time the sheep will actually eat their placenta. Um, it just gives back in uh, nutrients that they lost during lambing. Um, I try to encourage my sheep to do that, and if they don't, then I'll remove it then. So, we're going to go grab the ram lamb, and we're going to weigh, tag, blah, da, 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 da. Let's do this. Okay. And I'm probably going to gross y'all out, but this doesn't gross me out. I wish I hadn't went to vet school, so that's what her placenta looks like. There she is. Actually, she, wow, with my iPad, it's so different. We have a beautiful, but big, ram lamb. Huge! You are huge, little buddy. Huge! They're handsome, that's what I meant to say. Let's see how much he weighs. What do y'all think? Put it on. Tear it out. Alright, now we're gonna go get the lamb. Hey, little fella. Ooh. Okay. Alright, so... I know, this is running, sorry, I'm thinking he weighs like 10 pounds, but I'm not an expert, so. Oh, don't try to lay down on me. Right. See what you weigh, okay? Oh my goodness, boy. Eleven. Point eight zero, Biggest lamb that I've had to date. Look, bottle baby's coming to say hi. He's a big boy. 11 pounds. Wow, girl. You need some extra sweets. I love her because she's got the curly hair from Reba. Literally, she has the same curls. You have a big boy. You have a big boy. All right, let's tag him. So, let me get my little... Actually, I'm going to give him some Omega first. So, this is just like extra supplement. Um, so, put that in the edge. Two squirts. Mm, good. Good. Hello. Do you want some? <laughs> okay. So, I'm going to get a number out. So, this is called a scrapey tag. So, you're going to be 56. Now, these numbers don't mean anything because I never went in order. I just dumped them in a box per se and I just pick one out when I do it. So. We're gonna do the right ear. Do the right ear. We're gonna make sure the number's up. And make sure I don't get my finger. Okay, so here is their ear. 
This one has quite large ears, but it's 11 pounds. No judgment. You don't have sonars. It's okay, little buddy. Hello, Mom. Okay, so what I do is I look for the two veins you do not want to hit. So once you've done a couple, you kind of you kind of get used to it. So there's no veins there. So I'm gonna, just like getting your ears pierced. Their ear might droop down a little bit, but that's okay. It'll come back up. So there's its number. That's my farm number. And you're good to go, little Woody. You're good to go. Yeah. You're good to go. You're huge. You're huge. You're so big. You get all that blood off you and you might be a little bit more handsome. The two other lambs just decided that they were being left out. Had to come in here and get stuck in here. Do you miss your mom? Let's go get your mom. You want to go get your mom? You want to go get your mom? Yeah. Yes, and I talked to my sheep. <laughs> Yes, my bad. I'm not paying custody. Or am I paying custody? Dude, you just kicked me in the mouth. Is that poop? <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna stop videoing and give give you back. I'm gonna give you back, okay? <laughs> I'll go get her water, but I'm gonna keep the iPad on so y'all can just watch <laughs> a little bit. Okay, okay. Double trouble. Double trouble. Oh, you shouldn't have got it. So I bet Reeve will be tomorrow. Her belly is low. You're such a good mom when you have a baby you hey, Look, y'all, if you have a baby, you get extra lovings, which you already get enough, but you also get extra treats, and then you have a baby. So then, I'll be so happy to be a grandma. By the way, are you listening to me? No, she's gonna walk away and ignore me. This is so rude. Yeah, strut your stuff, girl. Strut your stuff.